Welcome back to Great Day SA. You may have seen them fluttering around our city, the beautiful monarch, but what does their journey look like? Well, we have Ashley Birdie here with Blooming with Birdie. We're gonna go on a trek, right? We are, we're gonna go through the migration. You're gonna become a butterfly today. Y'all, I already <laughs> am immersing myself in the field. They're so beautiful. They remind me of my godmother all the time, but oh. tell me about the beginning of their journey. Yeah, well, let's let's just jump into okay. it. So we're gonna go to Mexico first because that's where the monarch starts. So we're welcome to be Mexico. Perfect. We're in we're Mexico. Mexico. Pendant today <laughs> just for you. Thank there you, you go. <laughs> you got my five. So we're going to start in Mexico. It's spring. It's starting to get warmer. Okay. And so you are ready to mate and migrate. Oh, okay. So you have just been born. You are looking for a male monarch, okay. which is Gabe. Gabe. You all, yay. Yay. Buddy old pal, give me yeah, those so eggs. So you're going to get some <laughs> eggs from Gabe. Perfect. Now we're going to head to your host plant, which is milkweed, which we find in San Antonio. Okay. So you're going to lay your eggs. Lay the eggs. Lay your eggs. But now after you lay your eggs, you've served your purpose. This life cycle ends, so we're going to take off your okay. wings. Okay. But it's okay wings because are... you're reborn as an egg. Okay. And now as a caterpillar. Caterpillar <laughs> vibes, y'all. This is really neat, so okay? You're a caterpillar. You're going to eat your milkweed. Okay. So you can eat your milkweed, and you're going to get bigger and bigger until you are so fat that you are ready to go into <laughs> your Girl, chrysalis. Y'all don't Perfect. know it, but this is making me quite Perfect. full. Perfect. So All now right. you're going to go into your chrysalis. Okay. So you're going to hang out for just 10 seconds. So it represents about 10 days for your chrysalis. I'm getting big and plump. Getting big and plump in there. Mm -hmm. And now you're transforming to where now you are ready to emerge from your chrysalis again as a new monarch butterfly. Okay, y'all. So I'm so now we're going to fly north and do the whole process again. So we're going to do this process okay. three times, but we're not really going to wow, do three times. Wow, yeah, that's a lot. Three, four, even five times, the multi-generational migration. Okay. We're going to make it all the way to Canada. We're in Canada now. And what happens in Canada in the fall? A little cold, y'all. It gets cold. Not the vibe. It gets cold. So you're the fourth or fifth monarch. So now you are a super monarch. <laughs> so as a super monarch, you are going to try and make your way all the way back to Mexico. Okay as a super generation monarch. So now you have your monarch wings, but you have to collect your pollen and okay. your nectar in order to be able to survive. So try so. and find, but you have to evade your predators. Oh no, So, so the try and get your pollen. Collect your pollen. Collect the pollen. Collect the pollen. Collect the pollen. Collect the pollen. Oh, oh, the, the bird's coming. coming. The bird's coming. <laughs> the bird ate you. So maybe you didn't make it back, but we can try again. So let's try again. See okay, if you can make okay. it all the way back. So let me so get collect some more your pollen, pollen and nectar. Okay, getting the pollen, getting the nectar. Okay, I'm afraid. Have, okay so you have energy to make it to the next okay, one, so you can make it to go. your next one. Ooh. Ooh, the birds are evading the bird. You're evading the bird, and you made it all the way back to Mexico. Yay! In time for Dia de los Muertos. Cool. Bienvenidos. So this is truly what their journey looks like. Yes. So it's multi generational okay. in the spring, and then in the fall. Oh, it's a super monarch, like a super generation. And it flies all the way back to Mexico in, in time for Dia de los Muertos. That's so incredible. And they go through San Antonio as well. Absolutely. Tell me about what your passion behind this and what made you want to do this. You teach this to children as well, right? Yes, absolutely. So this is part of the Monarch Butterfly and Pollinator Festival. So we're doing a huge installation that is to scale where children will actually be the seven foot tall milkweed as if they were the butterfly for them to be able to firsthand have the experience of becoming a Monarch Butterfly. Yeah. This is so <laughs> interactive and cool. I never thought I would be. I've done a lot of things on Great Day SA, but I never thought I'd turn yeah, into a we'll monarch. Come on butterfly. Saturday, October the 8th, this Saturday from 10 to 2. Okay. We'll have this and we'll have monarch tagging where you can actually get tag a monarch butterfly mm -hmm. to be able to see if it makes it all the way to Mexico. And we have a surprise that has to do with a caterpillar. Really? And the train. Oh. But that's all I can say. That's all she can that's say. That's all I can say. Okay, so where is this happening? This is happening at Brackenridge Park. Okay, awesome. Well, you guys need to head out there Saturday, October 8th from 10 to 2 p.m. My girl here is so kind and you're so knowledgeable and passionate about this. I love your shirt. Oh, yes. Citizen scientist. scientist here. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for being with us and for teaching me and to, of course, the bird and my, my mates over there. Thank you very much for this educational experience. But y'all,